We should say, though, that along with the balloons and the floats, the Macy's Parade is going to include massive security today to protect the millions of people who come out to see the show. And ABC's Gio Benitez is right there along the parade route. Gio, good morning to you. Dan, good morning to you. That's right. They are taking security very seriously here. 500 additional police officers will be out here at this year's parade. This morning, New York City police on high alert protecting the parade and 3.5 million people. More than 3,000 officers on duty, some armed with heavy weapons, while others are in plain clothes hiding among the crowd. I'm worried about keeping everybody safe. That's our job. It's an important function, but we're well prepared. Authorities blocking off cross streets with more than 80 sand filled trucks and more than 100 blocker cars, all to prevent an attack like the one in Nice, France. Earlier this month, ISIS propaganda called the parade an excellent target. The FBI issuing this warning holiday celebrations beginning with Thanksgiving and the start of the shopping season could be targeted by international terrorists or homegrown violent extremists. There's no credible and specific information of any specific threat directed at this parade. But police aren't taking any chances, visiting 135 truck rental locations, making sure no one suspicious is trying to rent one. Just days ago, police in New York arresting this man who prosecutors say talked of attacking Times Square. So I got to tell you, even with all of this security, so many people here are just so excited about all of this. And Amy, I have one more stat for you. Cops outnumber clowns three to one. <laughs> That's probably a good thing, Gio. All right. Thanks so much for that.